Hello, I'm Scott Wyatt, President of Southern Utah University. Thanks for taking the time to explore majors with us. We want you to discover your passion and talent, so we created this series for you. Choosing a major may be overwhelming to some of you. These short interviews with professors began the process. What major are we spotlighting today, Ellen? This is Spotlight on Music with Dr. Steve Meredith. Thank you so much for being with us today. Happy to be here, Ellen, thanks. Great, so tell me, what do you love about your field? I think the best thing about being a musician is that we speak a universal language and being fluent and being able to speak and write and understand in that language uh, gives you a connection with people from virtually every culture everywhere. So you ha do you have to have a, mu a music gene to be in this? Uh I have to say that I don't know enough about uh, the field of hereditary medicine to, to, to know, but certainly what, what we do know is that, that uh, to a certain extent, a, a, a talent, if you will, uh, an intelligence for music is required to be a music major, but, but what's more important uh, is a willingness to work hard, to just put in the hours in the practice room, in the recital hall. I think most people don't realize just how time-consuming and grueling in many ways that is. My experience with students that start a little bit later or, or have interests that don't fall into the traditional classical realm is that they very often turn out to be some of our finest music students because they have a broad understanding of music. They came at it from a less than traditional pathway. What type of student would not be successful at being a music major? For a student who is just looking for the quickest way to a BA or BS degree, that they find that music is not the most expeditious way uh, to get there. I think also people that have trouble managing their time, uh, a musician's day tends to be more full in college than, than the, the typical collegian's day. And so they, they tend to be more diligent, more focused, uh, perhaps a bit more disciplined than, than the average student. So what, is, so what do you love about the program here at SUU? What's different about this program? One of the things to mention about SUU's music program is that we actually have three different degrees. Mm -hmm. for, for those who are interested in just a liberal arts degree in music, we have a BA program. And students that, that would like to just be involved in music but they don't necessarily want to make it their career or, the, or they want it to be in a, in a field related to music, having a BA in music is great. It's also, by the way, a tremendous degree to get uh, if you're planning to go to graduate school. The other two degrees that we have are a Bachelor of Music and a Bachelor of Music Education degree. These are the professional degrees for people who are planning to make composition, performance, or the teaching of music you know, as their, what they want to do for their life. I recommend that for people who, who want to be a professional musician, get a Bachelor of Music degree, get a Bachelor of Music Education degree. Get the greatest, the highest level of competence that you can in your specialty, but then start to redefine yourself as a musician. Can I play other instruments? Can I compose? Can I arrange? Can I teach songwriting? Am I good at music technology? This is the definition of the new modern musician, somebody that can do really well at a few things, but also does pretty well at almost everything else. That's, That's what we're after. That's terrific. Well, thank you so much. This has been a Spotlight on Music with Dr. Steve Meredith.